What's crack -a everyone? So today I have a Toy USA damaged box as well as a couple pickups from the Sendan and another one from Popular Opinion. Stay tuned. Okay, let's get started on these bad boys. Popular Opinion. I've had this for a while, so I got it from Cody. It was on a live he did where you could toss out, I think it was 20 bucks to help him get a new webcam. And you got um, a mystery box somewhat. He showed you if you wanted to see it. Oh, this is nice. Thanks, Cody. I'm more than willing to help out other YouTubers when they're on live streams trying to get money to better their channel. That is awesome that they're putting in all that effort. <coughs> Show you what I got. I know what I got. This is OG for me, and I was happy to get it. It's not a high value one, but it's a. Uh, for me, it's pops that actually bring out that inner child, things that remind you of so a special time in your life. And Battlestar. Galactica. It's Commander Adama. The original one. And that's from my childhood, of course. I'd like it if they did some Buck Rogers one at the same time period. It just cracked me up because Buck Rogers was hilarious. With Twinkie the robot. Awesome. Thanks, popular opinion. Okay. Got some from Mr. Sinden, Mike. Let's see what Mike sent me. One of these I might not be able to show you if he sent it directly to me. Uh, I can't remember. He was either going to send it to me or send it to the person that I was going to give it to. We'll find out. What do we got here? Oh, awesome. So I got the EB exclusive one. I got all the uh, ones from GameStop, but it's the EB version. Nice joker. That came out of the DC GameStop box. Then, I'd put a question mark on him. Here. There we go. That's right. It's my hero pop that I wanted. Which I think I already got again. But that's how it goes. You buy them and then sometimes you buy them off someone. And then at the same time you get one out of a mystery box. Although no, this is not the one I, I bought. So I bought the metallic. And this one is not the metallic. But he's awesome. He has that whole full cow hand. In the comic. Nice. Thanks, Sin. You got to buy off of... Uh, what is it, uh, Sin Sales? Or Sin Den Sales on IG. Keep an eye out. He tends to have a lot of good stuff. He has a very narrow collection, so no matter how good the pops are, he, he will get rid of them. If it doesn't fit into his narrow collection, so he ends up selling a lot of really good pops. I'm lucky enough to usually get first dibs. Okay, what do we have here? Okay, this is bizarre. This box, this sorter box feels uniquely odd. It's like the cardboard is stiffer. Okay. <laughs> I was more than happy to buy this off you. I needed this for my collection. Hell yeah, that's a great, 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 great deal. Awesome, blueberry, yeah. I'm not sure who he's going to replace yet, but he's definitely replacing someone. i got to find more room. <laughs> oh, yeah. Sorry, Dark Crystal. That's behind me. I have, I'm building a new Dark Crystal display elsewhere. This is more of my pop icon ones. So, welcome to the family, Boo Berry. I was so excited about that. It's one I off, checked off my icon list. One of the ones I try to get it out of mystery boxes but they stopped offering them in a lot of them some of them like blueberry so i said why not send give me an awesome price so 
I had to get it. Okay, on Toy USA Mystery Box. Four pops. I could only see the bottoms. There's always going to be. Let me get this bubble wrap off and I'll show you. Always going to be one in a protector and three not in a protector. That does not mean they're not good pops. See what I mean? The bottom one's in a protector. Okay, here we go. Oh, Eleven. <laughs> I love Stranger Things. I hate Stranger Things pops. I haven't had one appeal to me yet. Eleven. Although my youngest would love them. I should just start dumping them on him. There you go, bud. Hot Topic Vegeta over 9,000. I have one of these, but I started amassing my duplicates. Not for some like mystery boxing, but for a major giveaway. Start putting together collections for a major giveaway. Still trying to figure that out. I want to do it without like putting it in writing and only notifying people through videos. That way, uh, and maybe a little bit on IG, just so only my subscribers win. I don't want, you know, fake accounts, crap like that. They shouldn't be allowed. Gotta hook up the people that actually like my content. Okay. Vegeta. Another Vegeta. It's the con. That'll also be going in the mystery box. I'll put together a Vegeta mystery box for someone who's just starting. Not mystery box, giveaway. Okay, the last one, which is in the protector. Jesse Pinkman. Right on. I'm not sure if that one's a good pull, but it is an awesome, awesome TV show. You gotta love it. He actually looks a little bit more pimp than this one. Not the uh, weak sauce that he turns into. Let's see which one was in this. I need to collect them all. This is actually my first Breaking Bad, but I will get them all. Okay, let's check value on these bad boys. That's what I'm saying. Show me the money. As soon as I pull up that, and then let me share my screen. So I'm sure you'd like to know too. Hello. Place. And how about a calculator? I'll move this around. Put this bad boy under here. Okay. What did I grab first? Let's get that. Uh, it's a Vegeta. There he is. 15. Wow. He's held value. That's awesome. Okay, now here's the wanker one. Hello. What was that? 827. Ten dollars. Well, I was expecting that one to be like seven, though, so that's not bad. Oh, fifteen plus ten. <coughs> and I did not see damage on these, so that's pretty good. I don't know what you're thinking, Toy USA. Why you always send them out as damage? But I mean, they're not beat to butter or anything. They might be nine. I'm gonna say nine, but nothing, nothing really. Okay, Vegeta from New York Comic Con. 669. There it is. 16, 34. It's always tough to tell. What is it? This one has blue on it or something? Let me zoom in. There we go. Okay, so yes, so that's all white up there, which is the one I got. New York Comic Con needed to be a little bit more distinctive. And this one should have blue. Yes. Okay, so 
the con one is the one with the blue on it. So, yep. I got the $16 one. Plus, so I'm at 41. Um, we'll see how well Jesse Pinkman is. Where did I put Jesse? There you are, Jesse. Twenty-three. That looks like the one. So twenty-three. I made my money back. It's a sixty-dollar box. Made sixty-four, including shipping. I, I might have lost a little, but I don't count shipping, so I made four dollars. Awesome. <coughs> Let me know what you thought of my polls and my uh, grabs from Sinden. Let me minimize that screen for you. Um, the Booberry Man. <laughs> that's, that's tight, man. I'm loving it. I'm pretty happy about that. I don't care what I got out of the mystery box. I'm still happy with Jesse Pinkman, but the Booberry. Yes. That just helps fill a gap for me. So, need the Frankenberry and, and a few, quite a few others, but that's the great thing about the one collection I know I will collect that will get out of control, kind of like Star Wars and everything else, is at icons because they actually mean something to me means my childhood or just my younger years it's just awesome memories and it reminds me of that when i see it when i look at most star wars pops it reminds me of a big headed star wars pop so maybe uh, God, what was it uh, um you know what i'm talking about the spoof movie which was hilarious that they're supposed to make a part two of anyways let me know what your was your favorite if you liked anything if you thought it was all crap that's fine too um remember to like comment subscribe and stay awesome Oh!